We know, we all know, and especially yourselves who are at the front line of, of healthcare in Kenya, we know that there's a big problem. There's a big problem in terms of healthcare inclusion gaps. Uh, indeed, M-Pesa and mobile money has done a lot to financially include people, but when you look at healthcare, still two out of five Kenyans forego medical care on a regular basis because they don't have the money to pay for it. There's a lot of people, the vast majority of Kenyans, who don't have insurance. And also when it comes to the quality of care, there's a lot of quacks out there who don't have the licenses to, to, uh, to operate as a medical facility and patients don't really know what to look for when, they, when they, they're looking for quality care. So that is why we started MTBA. We want to fill those gaps and obviously we can't do that alone. We need to do that with you. You're the key partner in this battle. We've, we've started officially end of June last year and we launched it very silently. So we've heard quite some feedback from providers that there's not enough marketing going on, um, which we actually took seriously, but at the same time we started it very silently because we want to make sure that it works. There's been a lot of products that were launched in Kenya in the last few years that were launched with b very big stories and then it didn't work. That's why we did it a bit pole pole as you say here in Kenya, but in the end of last year we started putting some real marketing efforts behind it. And the growth is really, really fast. Like I said, it was 225,000 uh, now on my phone. But only last week, Wednesday, so a week ago, we celebrated 200,000 people. So it's growing really fast. That doesn't mean it's already translating in many people wanting to pay for MTBA with MTBA at your facilities. And we'll talk about how, how we're going to change that. Another thing that we aim to do with MTBA is try to get people to start planning for their healthcare expenses. So we started with a savings product and we're going to add some more uh, products later on in this year. And why do we think MTBA is going to be a success? Because it's all about partnerships. Everybody knows that this healthcare inclusion gap is something you cannot solve alone. We cannot solve it alone, you cannot solve it alone. You need strong partners to do that. And MTBA was founded by three core partners. Millicent already alluded to them. It's Safaricom, who you all know. It's PharmAccess Foundation, also um, present here in the room and, and on the, on the uh, program during, during the whole day. And it's CarePay, the company that I work for.